Hi, my name is David Wisner, and I am the Charge here at U.S. Embassy Tirana. Over the past year, it's been my intense pleasure to have served uh, here at the Embassy and with the Albanian people, and I will always remember the fond uh, and warm welcome that I've been given here. Um, it was a particular honor to welcome Secretary of State Antony Blinken, as well as actor and activist R.J. Mitty, and a huge uh, variety of American visitors uh, from justice sector to the military to the uh, economic domain. It's just been a year full of activity in building this wonderful relationship. I want to thank you for the incredible generosity you've shown my family and I. Now, go ahead and ask me some questions. What Albanian tradition will you take with you? Oh, that's easy. The incredible passion that Albania has for its football team. I'll be cheering for the Kuchesi wherever I go. Which place in Albania felt most like home to you? Well, I'm a country boy at heart. So my favorite place was uh, camping in Deber, and I really liked whitewater rafting in uh, Permet. How about you, Wiz? What did you like? I liked Vlora the most. What did you like about Vlora? Um, because there were really nice beaches. Which Albanian dish will you miss the most? I really loved the fresh fish here, uh, in particular, Kotsia Fresca. How about you, Wiz? What did you like? I really enjoyed the um, the tiramisu, and when we went to Scandibeg Square, they got to have hot dogs. <laughs> what was the biggest challenge you faced during your tenure? The biggest challenge I faced here was only having a year to be here. Gosh, I wish I'd had uh, a little bit more to have visited more of this great country, uh, but I consider myself deeply fortunate to have seen what I did. What advice would you give your successor? My successor, Nancy Van Horn, will be arriving shortly, uh, and I know she's gonna love Albania as much as I have. The advice that I'm gonna give her is to continue the great work that this embassy's doing in helping Albania move along its democratic path, building its defense ties with the United States, and building greater economic ties between our two countries to the benefit of both of our people. I know she'll have a terrific time doing that, and I know this embassy's really looking forward to building upon those great successes. Thank you all for the incredible memories you've given my family and I. Until we meet again. Mira Pavshim!